hello hello um it is saturday and i'm just now starting the vlog it is 5 40 it's dark and we're at walmart and people are staring at me um <laughs> but i just figured i'd go ahead and start it before i i ran out of time guys um yeah today was challenging i got off a little late i haven't edited the edited the vlog from yesterday we're at walmart i'm hungry uh, i've got maddie and janaya and i just wanted to start the vlog and say hello 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 Look at that. I love it. It says, have a meowy Christmas. Look, Manny. Look at this. I love that. That's cute. <laughs> There's a lot going on in Walmart. They have, like, police in there. You can't get out of Walmart unless you show your receipt. It's very busy in there. I, I guess because the Christmas season. I don't know, but they are, like, SWAT team up in there. Anyway, um, we got what we needed. We're gonna go get some food because they're starving, I'm starving, and then we're gonna go home. We are getting some chicken at KFC, which it used to be called Kentucky Fried Chicken, but they took the fried out. I guess it's, you know, healthy, but it's not, it's not healthy. Let's go, girls. Guys, I feel like I haven't talked to you properly. It is, I think it's almost eight o'clock and we came home, we ate, and we're gonna go um, look at Christmas lights. On my route today, I was delivering to a tailor, like a tailor shop, which I delivered yesterday. I did the same thing. Anyhow, um, I brought my two pair of winter postal pants to the tailor because the dang zipper broke. Not, I didn't break it, okay? No, they're, they're pretty old. And the zipper had like a cut, like some of the zip, <laughs> the metal part was off. Anyway, um, so she's going to put a new zipper and then she's going to hem uh, one of the pair of pants. Because I hemmed my postal, not the ones that, that are my nerd pants. I hemmed a pair of my um, winter pants and I did, it was perfect. So I told her, I was like, listen, just hem them the exact same length that I did. Because they, they turned out perfect, not like the nerd ones I'm wearing right now. Uh, but anyway, yeah, so I dropped them off at the tailor. I've never dropped anything off at a tailor. So, um, it is $20 for a zipper and hemming of the pants. Um, but yeah, it is, I think, it, I don't know, honestly, I don't know what time it is. Um, we're going to go look at Christmas lights. And yeah, I was going to go to Botanical Gardens, but we're just going to go to this neighborhood that um, is really nice and have really nice lines. So that's what we're going to do. Uh, they are having a lot of fun with their tiny hands and messing with that dang Google Home Mini. It'd be really nice, don't you think, if Maddie got one for Christmas? Hey, Google, stop. Did you know you can look up on uh, Google like a neighborhood map of Christmas lights? It's so funny because where we're going, I deliver the mail. <laughs> It's so funny, like becoming a mailman and like you deliver, you go on your route and you deliver this mail to all these houses, but then you don't think about how big of a, like a, how much of an area you have covered. Do you know what I mean? Like when I'm just driving through, I'm going somewhere and I'm passing through these neighborhoods that I've delivered to, it's like, dang, what, like the a route typically I think has between six to eight hundred houses like regular like a me medium I think I don't know because um, I know most of the routes that I deliver well when I was doing full routes it was like 800 houses minimum and when you think about that like you just deliver to 800 houses that's a lot of space anyway I need to go I took off my uniform my makeup is a mess hey Google what time is it it's 733 Wow, I thought it was 8 o'clock. Anyway, here are the girls. Here are the girls. Okay, we have to go. We have to go. That is so cool. This this house is playing. It's going by this song that's playing on the radio. How cool is that? We're back. Um, I drove around for almost an hour. Look at me. I, I drove around for almost an hour 
it was cool though because I, I followed like a route and it was basically, it was my whole area from my post office is where we were. So I was like navigating. I knew where I was going. Um, we saw some really, really cool lights. Um, people wanted to run me over. Okay. Let me tell you something. When I'm in the postal truck, I drive that and it took me a while to get used to driving like it just did because that thing's so big and I'm cool. Like I'm up there. I turn my lights on. Beep, 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 beep. Get out of my way. You know, I'm cool. Sometimes I wish I was driving the ProMaster like in real life. Um, cause when I'm in my car and like I have children with me, mm -mm. I don't drive like super duper slow, but I don't drive fast and some people get mad at me. I drive the speed limit first of all. Anyway. So a couple people like were like me 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 when I was trying to like get to the anyway anyway uh, once we got into the neighborhoods we were cool <laughs> man people are in a rush like for what then we drove by botanical gardens and they have beautiful lights beautiful um, but I guess right now because we almost like turned in to go we were gonna go. Um, but I guess right now you, you can walk it. They're not drive. You can't drive through it yet. So I get up on the Google, boop, 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 boop. you know, when, when can we next weekend, we can start driving through. Okay. How much is it? Google, how much is it to drive through Norfolk Botan Botanical Gardens to look at some Christmas lights, which are beautiful. I'll give them that. How much? Well, let, let me tell you a couple of years. It's been maybe two years since we've gone. Um, it costs about 10, 15 bucks. Okay. Well, can't be any different, right? Wrong. It's $30 a car. But if you go Monday through Thursday, it's 25. What? $30? That's crazy. Am I a Grinch? No, but I feel like that's very expensive. 30 bucks. Uh, yeah, so tell me what you guys have been doing. It is December 7th right now. Have you done anything Christmassy? Uh, have you done any Christmas shopping? Is your tree up? Are you done Christmas shopping? Or are you just starting? Are you going to make a big dinner? Have you made Christmas cookies? Anything Christmas related, let me know. Have you done it? I guess this counts as a first Christmas related thing. Driving through. It was fun. We're just randomly driving. Me and this car with these girls driving through neighborhoods. <laughs> and then we went in the really fancy neighborhood. Like the real snazzy one. Um, <laughs> the houses are like huge. The last time I went, which was a couple years ago, I went in my uh, neon that was like... <laughs> Falling apart. <laughs> and I'm over here driving through these million dollar homes and neighborhoods in my car that's falling apart. Doesn't have a muffler and loud as hell. <laughs> I was like, they're going to call the cops. Um, uh, but anyway, I mean, it, it, it made it through, you know. I drove that car down to the ground, but not this one. In which I will update you. I'll let you know what's going on. Anyway, everywhere you look in my house, you're going to find a cat. Maddie is a master chef. She has learned how to make a salad. So she's making herself and Janaya a salad. Put some Please salt and pepper. No, I don't like it. But I'll ask her if she wants some. That's a lot. I like my ranch. That, that's good. Stop. Poopy. Stop. <laughs> that's a lot. What? There are Maddie's salads. Alright guys. I literally just washed my face. I get my hair. Uh, put my lotions and potions on. This is getting a little bit better. Um, I've been putting the coconut oil. But I did see my good friend left a comment uh, to get some aquafir. Aqua aquafir. I have to go back and look. Um, it's not better, but it feels a little bit. Anyway, um, I should get some of that. I did the dishes. Everything is clean. I got the heater on because it is cold. The girls are watching Too Cute. And they're probably about to pass out because Maddie got up super early. Anyway, 
Um, do you guys watch Amberlynn Reed? Some of you probably don't even know who I'm talking about, but then some of you do. Um, and we all know the cycle. If you do, you will understand all this. Uh, we all know the cycle. And she, I think she's in a cycle right now where she's like, weight loss, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. Because I started watching her years ago when she had just started one of her weight loss cycles. And I was like rooting for her. Not that I'm not, but it is it is a weird thing watching her. Like, it just, I don't know. So, if you guys are do watch her and you know what I'm talking about, what do you think of the cycle that she's in right now? Do you think it's going to last? Do you think a couple more days and it's it's over, it's a wrap? I think it would be so awesome if she really continued it and she lost, like, all her weight. I mean, I really think it would be a great thing. And then also... Again, if you guys watch this, uh, Tammy and Amy Slayton, did you hear that they have a show um, coming out in January on TLC? Uh, I think it's like the Thousand Pound Sister, something like that. And Amy Slayton got weight loss surgery, but I don't think Tammy did. But they're going to be on TLC, which I think is pretty cool. I mean, I started watching them a long time ago. Uh, I don't know. Um <laughs> Anyway, uh, but yeah, they got their little show going, and um, I guess Amy, I mean, she's had the surgery. I haven't gone to her channel to, like, watch her or anything, but they say, like, she looks like she's lost a lot of weight, so I don't know. Let me know what you think about that, too. Have you watched them? Do you know what I'm talking about? Amberlynn Reed and the Slayton sisters. YouTube is a very big place. <laughs> Lots of places to get lost in. Um, but right now, I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog. I'm going to go sit in my living room and relax. Like I said, they're probably going to be going to sleep soon. Um, and I probably will, too. We had a really good day, really good night. Uh, well, I mean, the day was <laughs> busy. Listen, they gave me three and a half hours, which I can do. I can knock it out. No big deal. But today, they gave me three and a half hours that I feel like was four and a half but what am I going to say? Bring it back and say, oh, no, this is four and a half hours. No. And when I saw it, I was like, that's, that, don't, that doesn't look right. Because I had literally done the same exact three and a half hours yesterday that I was doing today. But there was a lot more to it. Like, there were a lot more streets out. Anyway, so, yeah, really, what are you going to do? Say, oh, well, that's not three and a half. That's not three and a half. I'm only going to take three and a half. No, I picked it up, and I took it, and I said, okay, three and a half, got it. But I, it, I don't think it was. It, w it wasn't, because I finished by the skin of my teeth to start collections, and I was moving like a mad woman, because I knew it was over. I knew it was, and I was getting it. Um, yeah, I was moving like a crazy woman, uh, and I got it done, but I just, I don't know. <laughs> but, I mean, it, it got done, and... The mail went out. Everybody got their mail. Everybody got their Aldi coupon because we're getting a new Aldi. So there you go. Everyone should be using that. <laughs> All right, guys. I love you guys, and I will talk to you tomorrow. As always, we're doing good, guys. As always, I will vlog again tomorrow. Bye, everyone.